welcome back to my channel. I have went to the five below. We have a small five below haul. I just got some things that I really wanted to share with you. So let's dig in. First thing, and first and foremost, I want everybody to stand up and applaud, if you can stand up, and applaud for five below. This five below shopping bag was five cents. You know, it's really funny because for an environment, we really want the environment to like thrive and we wanna stop putting um, single use items out there in the world. But they charge you like a dollar for a bag. And I understand that that's like their capitals and capitalism and you have to like have a profit. But seriously though, does it really cost you more than five cents to make one of these? And why does this have to be one of your profitable items? Do you know what I mean? We're trying to save it. We're, we're trying to get people to use them. Don't charge you a dollar. I'm just saying. Okay. We got a couple of things and I'll share with you some stories. We have a little story time with some of these things too. Well, we actually put all this stuff in regular bags, but don't we repurpose them before I found out that they had these. Um, so Jimmy was at self-checkout most of the time there. Now at my five below's anyway, five below's I've been to. And um, yeah, I just thought that it would be really neat to share with you all the things that we got. All right, let me just get it. One thing, like I said, is missing um, the box for because we put two things in the car already. I'll show you the first one that I have the box for. This is a dual cup holder. This is one of their uh, five Beyond items. Yeah, this was $8. This was one of their five Beyond items. So they have some things that are more than $5. Well, a lot of their things are more than $5 now, but they're like $5.95, uh, $5 up to $5.95. Um, but then they have a whole section that's five beyond. So anything that's, anything that doesn't start with a five or lower goes in the five beyond section. And this was $8 and it seemed like a kind of a lot of money for $8. But when I saw the quality, I was like, nope, it's perfect. And here's the thing that I love the most about it. It is a dual cup holder. Um, just to show you, I'm going to flip over the back because I used it yesterday on my way home from Springfield and I absolutely like 100% recommend this. If you're a person who loves your iced coffee but still needs water, I know that that sounds dumb. I do have a center console that has like cup holders in it, but usually I, so I keep the garbage can and then, you know, like my cell phone. So my cell phone doesn't flop around. And I know this cell phone holder says a whole nother story, but being the passenger, you don't always have control over where you can put stuff. So I got this. It comes with these foam pads so that this bottom part fits snugly in whatever cup holder you have. Um, if your cup holder is adjustable, it, you know, like moves with the cup, that's not really good to have anyway. So usually you have the kind that lock, it work with that, it'll work with any cup holder size because they, again, you can expand this bottom cup to fit, but it also comes quite small. The top rotates over and out, and I don't think they have a picture of it rotated on, uh, sitting on top. Oh, that's what this is. So it's rotated closed there. And you can see that one cup holder just sits on top of the other. So if you only have a single cup, you could still use it. You won't have to remove it and you could still use it. The thing I love the most about it is that top cup holder is super expandable. <clears throat> so you guys might know or might not know that I just got a new water bottle. That is my 24 hour water bottle. And I need to drink that much water while I'm on chemotherapy. So the fact that that water bottle will fit in this cup holder was the game changer. It is sturdy enough for it to hold. Um, we won't flip over because of the fact that we put those pads in the bottom. But yesterday traveling home, I just to give you an example, I had my soda in the bottom and my water bottle in the top. And I will tell you that it worked like a dream. I recommend highly $8 if you're a person who likes a lot of drinks and women love cup holders so you know how that goes or you might be in a car that only has one cup holder and you need to share it with a partner or your guest okay the other thing was a and I'm going to take uh insert pictures of it here it is a cell phone holder that attaches to the back of your rear view mirror I actually think uh this was sort of like a hit or miss item was it going to work for us I, Jimmy loves it. I think it's gonna be perfect for both of us. You guys know when I travel and I vlog, I never look at the, the camera. I always look at the um, the road, but the camera is set up by the rear view mirror in case I need to use the GPS or if I need to um, see who's calling, if it's an emergency or whatever, I can glance over at it. But this, the fact that it hangs right below the rear view mirror is actually almost in your sight. You barely can take your eyes off the road to see what's going on on your phone if you're following a GPS, which Jimmy was yesterday, 
it was perfect for him. It adjusts to different size mirrors, thickness and like thickness because some mirrors have like computers behind them so it adjusts to the thickness of mirrors and also the height and width of mirrors because it's a flex it's a oh gosh spring loaded and then the where you hang your phone further back or close up that's also adjustable i love it i haven't driven with it yet but it looked really like it was working perfect for jim yesterday so i highly recommend that one too jim got this he has posture um equipment basically things that help him remind him to uh, put his shoulders back but he doesn't always remember to wear it but I think he's gonna remember this one for seven dollars he got a posture corrector Bluetooth speaker I think it's a Bluetooth speaker that's what he said it was I don't even know maybe it's just uh, connected to Bluetooth to tell you to stand up straight I'm not sure but <laughs> if you could see it there um it might vibrate to tell you to stand up straight this is what he told me again i was the person who was the passenger and he wanted to see it let's see what it says it says oh smart center detects oh it's not a bluetooth speaker he's gonna be very disappointed but i'm gonna love it i'm gonna make him wear it every day it detects when you're slouching again and it reminds you to stand up straight that's great don't tell him it's not a bluetooth speaker we'll tell him later <laughs> after he puts it on Okay, so we got a few different things. We got one more thing for the car, for sure. I think I think maybe even more, but I think one more thing for the car, for sure. Um, oh! So I will share with you, we got, he got some incense. Um, they're absolutely all smell wonderful. They no longer have the bag, or this store didn't have the bags to put the incense in. So literally they were just floating around. So all of them kind of got mixed together, which kind of stinks, but they smell really good. We got ones that were ocean. If you notice, they're all color coded on the bottom. So um, we got some that are ocean, some that are mixed with sage, just some beautiful scents. So he got those. Jim likes to do incense when he's in his office um, doing Bible study and also like, uh, you know, genealogy studies and that type of thing. I wanted these, this is one of those backflow uh, incense holders that kind of drapes the smoke down. We're out of backflow um, uh, cone incense cones, but um, Jim said he's going to go to Walmart and get them because that's where he originally found them. So I got this, and this was five dollars. Um, the one he got at Walmart was like six ninety nine, so it wasn't like super cheaper, super much cheaper. But I love this design. I love this design. One more car accessory. I have been having my eyes on these forever, forever. And yes, it's like kind of like when you're driving, this would be great. If you're a person who can eat and drive safely, then this would be great for the driver. However, this is great for the passenger. Like, where are you gonna keep your, your I'm gonna hold the dip while I try to dip the thing and where's my cup and a fry here and food on my lap? No, I think these are super cute. They're basically dip cup holders for your favorite foods and they hold like the prepackaged squares but they also come with these little cups, which you can wash and actually fill with like the squeezable ketchups and stuff like that. I think that they're super cute. I got, uh, they were 525, so you got two for 525. Okay. I found this headband, it was 325. Oh, I thought it said $1.25. Dang it. Bring it back. Bring it back. But it is so much nicer than the one at the Dollar Tree. That's why I got it. I was like, I got some of these from the Dollar Tree, but I really love this one. It's really like the quality feels better, feels softer on my head, and I love the bow in black. But now that I'm, it was 325, I'm trying to like rethink it because that's a lot. I'm just kidding. I just. So I found this. This is called a Slim Grip. Now I love a pop socket. It's kind of like how I hold my phone. It helps with my arthritis. I don't have to grip a phone like this. I can just stick it between every which two fingers that I want to. Um, and it can also use it to stand. The problem with pop sockets is they don't work with automatic chargers. So my iPhone 11 Pro comes with um, the capability of charging on a um, wireless charger. And they call it a wireless charger. It is plugged into the wall, but you don't have to plug your phone into it. The problem is with pop sockets, you cannot connect the wireless charger. However, this says you can. So it's a spin pop. So you twist it so it comes out. And it says it's so slim that it works with the wireless chargers. And we're gonna try. Because girl knows I had to give up my wireless charger because I couldn't take this case off every day. 
Now this I loved. These are some, two of these things I was looking at Amazon for a while and I had them in my case. So I was like, for four pieces for $5, I'm gonna go ahead and get it. So this is by Podskins. It does come with a pod holder, but I really like the one that I have now, so that's okay. Jimmy said he might just keep it with his stuff. But these ear pod holders that you wear around your neck and these ear pod um, that fit inside your ear better um, so they don't squeeze inside your ear, things I had in my Amazon cart. Amazon wants to charge you like $9.99 for these and like $12.99 for this. But then the one they have is a pretty necklace as opposed to just a chain. But that's the one I was going to buy. So for $5, I got them plus extra stuff. So that's why I got that. Jimmy and I have really been into like holistic medicines lately and um, really trying to find like anything that we can to really help with anxiety and with um, healing of the cancer and the body. So when I saw this, I thought it was something to get and whether or not we keep it or we read it and then gift it on, that's, we don't know. But this one is uh, chakras and auras and the chakras are just like your, your um, I don't know, like your energy ports that go down your body. Let's put it that way. Just nice and little, little way to put it. And this is the power of intuition. And um, they're just a two set book that you get for $5. And I thought that was really cool to have. And then the last thing is something we bought from mom. Or I bought from mom. Mom does um, started, she does oil paintings, but she's been using markers, but she thinks she might go to painting, painting, and might want to do some on where she's sitting on the bed. And when I saw this, I thought it was just really perfect for her. Um, it is just a um, $5 easel. It's an adjustable art board and it's got like um, uh, like, a, like a stopper here to hold whatever it is she's working on plus whatever paintbrush or marker she has at the time. And I just thought it was really nice. It looks like it's made out of wood or bamboo. I'm not 100% sure what wood that is because it kind of does have a grain like bamboo but it's probably just a, a sorry. Oh, that's the name of the company. I thought it said the kind of wood, but it's the company's wood industry. Uh, so anyway, it's 15, 15 and three quarter inches by 12 inches. So it'll hold her art. She does hold her art up as she goes because it's like on rollable canvas. So I got that for her. She doesn't even know we got it yet. So I can't wait to share it with her. And that's my Five Below haul. Um, if you guys have any questions. Oh, we tried to find, this Five Below was kind of jacked up. <laughs> I want to tell you, I'm not, I'm not lying and I'm not trying to insult anybody. It looked like they needed help. Um, we were trying to find, we when we go to Five Below, we always get mom the individual snack size of Charleston shoes. They're in the 10 for a dollar uh, section of candy, but they, not only did they not have Charleston shoes, but like the candies were all mixed together. The ones that they did have, they didn't really look that great. So um, then I tried to find them in a bag, because sometimes you can find them in a bag, but they weren't there. So um, unfortunately no Charleston shoes for mom, but we did get her this already. So um, yeah, that's it for now. If you guys have any questions, please, 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 please leave them in the comment section down below and I will try to tell you whatever you need. This particular um, Five Below was in Springfield South is what they call it. It was um, in the um, shopping center across the street from Target, if that helps, um, on Glenstone Avenue. So if you're interested, I don't know if it's the only one they have since they're growing and expanding so much. So that I would just let you know that. Um, as always, don't forget, I love you. And if you have not heard today, if you are loved, you can always come by and hear how much I love you. Cause I guys, I love you so much. That's why I share all this stuff with you. I'm not bragging. I am not being, excuse me, boastful or trying to be like, ha ha ha, I got this and you didn't. I literally share this with you cause I love you. And you might be look, I'm so sorry. I got, I have to eat. Cause I've got those, you have any in a while hiccup burps things? Mm excuse me um I really truly share this stuff with you because if you're looking for something that you thought was you know you can only buy for $12 then you can know that it's at five below if you need to okay all right, all right. and as always you guys take care god bless we'll see you next time bye